Steven, we did not stay up all those late nights just so you could avoid doing a Ducks video. Now you get over here and make it. I don't want to. Yes, you do. You have to. I'll make the video to at least learn how to defend. Zaitsev had an assist. Hi, everyone. Oh. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> Five two against against the Ducks. I don't want to do this. Ah, oh, friggin' first goal was Ricard Raquel. He wears number sixty seven. The Leafs gave the Ducks the pick. The drafted him. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, they picked Tyler Biggs. They moved up and picked Tyler Biggs. The other pick was John Gibson. How don't you know that yet? Then Zaitsev puts it on. Hyman scores. Ties it. Good for you. Kadri gets the lead. Isn't that wonderful? Isn't that great? Less than four minutes later, Silverberg. There you go. Tie. And Raquel. Sixteen seconds later, because it's impossible for the Leafs to defend anything. And that was the game-winning goal. Leafs lose 5-2. There was an empty netter. Let's talk about that for five minutes. Look, plus minus is stupid. Over the course of a season, over the course of a career, it's stupid. But minus four in one game, which is what Marner, JVR, and Bozak were. <laughs> I hate caring about this team again. Oh, they gave up a second round pick, man. They gave up a second round pick to Tampa. Tampa Bay, divisional rival. Oh my goodness, and you just know that player is going to turn out to be Ricard Raquel times John Gibson plus Duke Rask. Freaking garbage. The Leafs are Tantalus plus Sisyphus times both of them. I came into the season expecting so little, and I'm still like, Oh, well, that's a great analysis of the game there, see? Shut up! I'm allowed. Okay, I'm allowed to be emotional. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Hey, you know what? We've come this far. We've come this far. We know the Leafs are better than this. They're better than we've seen the last three games. And even against the Sharks, they didn't have a great game, but... <laughs> with like 90 seconds left it was tied. With the Kings went off his face. Shootout. And the Ducks can't. No, they were bad. They were bad in that game. They had a 2-1 lead. They were bad. What this team needs is a rest. This team needs a rest and a reset. They need to go home, get a good night's sleep, have a, have a hearty sandwich, hu hug someone, and, and then have a really good practice where Mike Babcock goes, if you do a bunch of the stuff that you did the last three games, I will actually strangle you! So that's what the Leafs need. That's what the Leafs, what do you need? How about you? Let's check in on you. Let's check in on the health of you, the Leaf fan. Who's actually sad the Leafs aren't playing this Saturday night? Anyone? Anyone? Anyone, anyone after all that? No one? You deserve this weekend off! This is it, this is great. The Leafs can't hurt you today. The Leafs can't hurt you tonight. The Leafs can't hurt you this weekend. All right, so here's what you're gonna do. Following this video that I'm sure will eventually be used as evidence to lock me away forever for the safety of the public, you are not gonna think about the Leafs for the rest of the weekend. Mm-mm, mm-mm, not you. Mm -mm. It's done, that's done, you're not doing that. You're gonna do, I don't care. You're, you're gonna do whatever. You're gonna do anything except Think about the Leafs. Well, what can I do? You know what you can do? You, you know what you can do? Are you in school? Maybe, maybe do a little bit of homework. Ah, that's boring. That's stupid. Okay, you know what? You're going to do something for you. This is just for you. You're going to read a book. Beginner level, read read five pages. That's all, I, that's all I want. Give me five pages. And if you make it that far, you might as well elevate to normal one chapter. Expert level, finish the whole damn book. Let's face it, most of you aren't going to do that. Like, dude, five chapters, man. Hey, hey, you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna talk to a friend. Or, or a family member or something that you haven't spoken to in a long time. That's what you're going to do. Oh, okay, I'll do that right now. No, like this. You're going to bite the bullet and conquer your fears and dial their number and call them. And if it goes to their voicemail, you're going to leave one. And if they don't have a voicemail, yeah, maybe text them. That, that, I mean, not a lot of people have it anymore. Eat something healthy for you. Or eat something bad. I don't give a crap. Go for a walk. If, if it's sunny outside, go for a walk. If it's cold outside, bundle up. Go for a walk. If it's warm outside and you can wear shorts, congrats on your Ducks victory, you bunch of jerks. Do some push-ups. Jumping jacks. <gasps> Pet a dog. Iggy. Oh, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. You're my favorite. You're my favorite. Look at you. Look at you trying to get a win in California. Oh, almost. Almost. I love Oh. Well, that wasn't planned. Hey, you go out and enjoy yourself. You do whatever you got to do to make you happy. And when we come back on Tuesday, oh, they don't even play till Tuesday. When we come back on Tuesday, we are going to come back rejuvenated, rested, reinvigorated, inspired, and ready for the playoff run because the Leafs are going to make it there whether I have to drag them kicking and screaming or not. 
So that is it for this one. Thank you very much for watching. Click like if you like this video. Click subscribe if you really like to tell all your friends. And this weekend works for you and not the other way around. Coconut water. It's yummy.